I forgot to write it all down today. So yesterday we finished the healing axe. And today we're working on an extruder. And we'll be working on... Wait, that's a mixer. I, I want to do the extruder. Hmm. Hey, Stefan, how you doing? No work today? Venom? All right, so from here, coal mine. Mine. We should have quite a number of coal mines, right? Wow, why does it seem like it's so far away? There we go. Full ore chunk caving required. Yeah, we're okay on. Okay. Wait for a second to that. <laughs> snow it has to be snow into a cauldron wow wow sounds like that's going to be kind of difficult to keep running right I am not sure how I'm going to work this. That lone sheep up there. All right, so we've got some of that. Let's put this away. Hey, look, Stefan, I got the healing axe. All right, so I think um, I'm working on a couple things. The first thing I want is the mixer. I'm going to have to work through to the extruder at some point, but right now I'm working on trying to get the mixer. That sucks. Drop. Jump. Thank goodness for feather falling, right? I don't know what I'm going to use the mixer for. It was just the first thing on my list. Okay. I, I need lots of coal right now, so... Doing a little caving in order to work on some coal.
hear it up there. Maybe it's in here that I hear it. In there. I like that coal veins are so big. Run away. Holy crap, 392 hit points? I mean, I'm glad I'm in 1710 because we can spam click. sneaking up behind me. What's that guy's problem? Jeez, this place is freaking warring of spaces that I don't really want stuff coming at me from. Huh. All right, so let's start uh, like here. Two, three, four, five. Pick up the floor and the ceiling. So this counts as floor for here, but we're gonna have to make a staircase here. So we can go up one level there. All right, so that was five. So let's go five this way. I like cold uh, deposits. There seems to always be lots of coal in it. And how can I double my coal? Is there a way I can double my coal like I double other ores? Huh. Well, that's interesting. Let's let's see if we can think of a way to double. Let's see if we can find a way because we can just straight smelt it. All okay. So you get double core, double coal from. The nether coal and double coal from the end coal. The centrifuge 
that's a no. That's weird. Carpenter centrifuge sifting purified coal ore can get you lots of different coal. All right. Pulverizer doesn't get us a good chance of doubling it. Unpackaging is different. Centrifuge forge hammer. Double forge hammer. Ta da! All right, so that's what I need to do. Forge hammer it. Now we know. big amounts of chart. I can see that. I can I can understand the reasoning behind it too. One, one, two, three, five. But, you know, when you find a coal vein, you end up getting butt tons of coal. So there's really not a reason for you to constantly work. I mean, I guess you can constantly work. I could be constantly working the charcoal with the uh, sacred oak, couldn't I? Because we've seen what, what we can get out of that sacred oath. Lots. All right, so there's one, two, three, four, five. What the frick? Are you kidding me? And so the only way to get rid of all this water would be to... Oh, what the heck? Can I not get rid of the water? What the heck was that? No, stop it.
Huh. Look at that. Down to one heart. Hello. Not Nanoka. How are you? Got one trying to get me to come back closer to them. Let the healing axe do its job. Can I use charcoal dust to make now that you're mentioning it, I, I didn't really check. Probably could have used charcoal dust. I hear them, but I don't see them. Where the heck are they? Naoko? Okay. Sorry if I mispronounced it before. So let's work on getting this thing all fixed. Ah, there it was. I knew I had heard others. Come on. Get closer so I can kill you. I'm hearing a skelly, too. You get away. Come on, jump in the water, dude. Since when do silverfish have so much health? Tough silverfish figures. Yeah, a time to kill silverfish. I'm hearing a skelly, and I'm not liking that I'm hearing a skelly. Okay, so let's go around the corner here. Got to fix all this. Well, yeah, the Drowned Creeper kind of just, you know, gives you a plethora of silverfish because it's stupid like that. All right. Now. No. Get off of me, stupid silverfish. 
Hey, you can eat that. How about that? All right. Okay. I'm glad that I have my hammer because this would be pretty sucky without it. So grab more. I had this whole area lit up at one point. Yeah, that's all gone by the wayside now. Is that an iron sword with bane of anthropods and an iron axe with unbreaking? Nice. The cool thing about if there is a cool thing about the silverfish is that once you get to a certain point they've all hatched if you will and then you can just you know go through this process all right so one two three four Five, two, three, five. Light this place up if we can. One, two, three, four, five, two, five. All right, so lit that up a little bit. Now let's go back down here and see if we can get rid of some of this down here. Okay. Yeah, probably going to get more coming out here. That's a lot of water. A lot of water. Swim, 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 swim. There we go. 
All right. Grab lots of these rocks. Start putting them at the top again. Okay, now good. Give ourselves a little bit of a space there. Come on. Yeah, getting rid of these is sometimes not fun. But it's not like it can't be done. It just takes a little bit of patience. Get closer and closer to where we were. All right, so that's the end of 49B. And to think, all I wanted to do today was just do some quick stuff, right? Because, you know, that's what I get for thinking I was going to be able to do some quick stuff. All right, we'll be right back.